Hi guys, this is Sam with Spieler Custom Baits. Today we're going to be going over how to tie my shad pattern bucktail jig. We're starting off with a quarter ounce tungsten 2 aught jig. And we're going to start off with a little bit of adhesive on the shank just to get that thread to stick a little bit better. We're going to be starting off with some black 200 denier thread. And we're going to tie it down and then tie back up to the hook shank and cut that tag end off. All right, we're going to start off with a little bit of bucktail here, cutting off a piece. And then we're going to fan it, pinch it and fan it out and get rid of those guard hairs. Starting off with the white, a few loose wraps just to get it to stay in place and then to tie it down and really lock that in. We're going to start off with white on the top and the sides, pinching it just to move it where we want it. And we're going to repeat this process a couple of times until we get that hook shank covered up. Cutting off a piece of another bucktail and getting rid of those guard hairs. And we're going to tie that right in on the other side. Loosely wrapping it in, moving it and manipulating it where we want it, and then locking it down. Cutting off another piece. You're going to want to cut these down closest to the hide as you can. And we're just going to add a little bit on top just to cover up that bait keeper. Loose tie in, manipulate it to where we want, and then really tie it down and in. And for a little bit of that cleanup with some of that hair that's sticking out, just get that to come back down and pulled in. Then we're going to flip it over and on the bottom side of this bait, which technically when it's in the water will be the top side of the bait. We're going to add a black line to mimic that shad-like color. Cut off a piece of black bucktail and then fanning it out to get rid of those guard hairs again. Then we're going to kind of measure it up. And loosely tie it in. Get it kind of positioned where we want it. And then lock it into place. And we're going to come through and whip finish this. Lock that in. And whip finish it again. Snip off the thread. And then you're going to 
take whatever epoxy that you prefer and we're going to cover that thread with it just to prevent fraying. This bait gets to depth pretty nicely and really it's a simple simple mimicking of a bait fish. Oh, just a little bit extra there, clip that off. And it's a, and it's a simple bait that is pretty effective. And that's the Shad Pattern Bucktail. Thank you guys so much for watching.